First Defense Weather is sponsored by 42 Degrees and Sunny, smoking deals on smoking accessories. Learn more at 42DegreesAndSunny.com. That's 42DegreesAndSunny.com. Fast, accurate, and every day, First Defense Weather. to you. It is the last day of March. Where is the month gone? And uh, the last couple of days, it's like whiplash when it comes to the weather around here. 41 was the high on Monday. Look at yesterday at 68. And then the high for today was 58, but that occurred early in the morning. Most of us did not even experience that 58 degree high because we've been going down through the 40s throughout much of the day. And uh, so, yeah, we wish we were joking, but it's not. We've got some snow on the way for tomorrow for April 1st. So same thing we told you yesterday. Cold air wraps around a low that's going to track along the northeast coast and we're going to see some wet snow showers developing overnight through the day tomorrow. As we stand right now, I think this is a good estimation here, about one to three inches in general. Once you work further to the east and south, you're going to get closer to the storm center, so therefore you're going to see the most amount of snow, maybe upwards of three to six inches there. Now there is a winter weather advisory for Allegheny County that goes until five o'clock tomorrow afternoon. No other part of western New York or northwestern Pennsylvania is under an advisory and the reason the advisory was issued is because this is where you're going to start to see the heaviest amounts of snow lightly about three to five inches out there so the advisory was warranted for out there but you'll see on future scan here we've got some rain showers through the day today and lots of cloud cover temperatures going the opposite direction falling from our high of 58 we're likely going to end the day around 40 41 especially here in the city tonight as that cold air wraps around you'll see the change over to snow showers and this is wet snow showers so the good news with the wet snow showers is it doesn't really accumulate too much but we do think the snow showers are going to continue through the day tomorrow at least in scattered nature we may actually see some pockets of limited lake effect coming off Lake Erie. Remember Lake Erie it's completely ice free and uh, so we could see some limited lake effect uh, setting up on the back edge for Thursday. So snowfall totals here we're looking at again about one to three inches. You can pick out your town and uh, see your uh, location here but again once you work out towards uh, Allegheny County further to McKean and Potter County Pennsylvania as you could see upwards of three four five inches there. Uh, Olean may get close to four inches of snow there so you may need the shovels further out to the east if you're across the western southern tier, maybe not so much. So temperatures going the opposite way today, the wrong way. Scattered on and off uh, rain showers through the day. Tapers off later in the afternoon. A bit breezy. These were the high temperatures today. 54 was the coldest I could find. That was at the uh, um, uh, that was at the Olean Airport. 58 here in town will fall to 40 to 45 by the end of the day. As we head into tonight, snow showers develop around a half inch to one and a half inches tonight alone. And again, that's by the morning hours. 24 to 29 with a west wind 9 to 18 miles per hour. 42 degrees and sunny seven day only 30 degrees. Look at the, the average 50, 20 degrees below average here. About one to three inches of daily accumulation. Friday, a nice day. Oh, they're all cold. 35 and lots of sun. We could see at least a, a scattered afternoon rain shower on Saturday, 52. Easter Sunday looking dry with highs in the uh, upper 50s. And then as we go into next week, uh, it's looking much better. High pressure stays, which means a good amount of sunshine and temperatures in the lower to mid 60s.